Okay, now we have the policy committee meeting of the Board of Trustees, um, February 26, 2018, and at 655. Number one, call to order. <laughs> Item number two, review discussion on update 110. All right, you have uh, in front of you a list of the uh, policies that TASB is recommending be updated through um, the update 110. Um, most of these are legal policies, and these are all um, due to changes in legislation. Um, there are, there is one local policy, BBB, and if you scroll down to the attachment to page, well, it starts on page one, um, there's significant restructuring of the election policies with the legal, and then on the local on page two there, um, they've revised it based on the election information that we gave them for our district. Um, it includes the district's election decision as allowed by law, including the fact that we do three, four, and off year, um, the length of the, of the current board member terms and election schedule, the general election day for the district, and the methods of election and voting. Um, so it's not a change, it's just a reflection of the um, upcoming dates uh, based on, on our current policy. The rest of these, I believe, are all legal policies. Item agenda. Wait, uh, go ahead, um, Mr. Dr. Cameron. Is there any policy <clears throat> in reference to uh, when officers are elected to conduct a meeting? So I'd like to. Uh, yes. And, and I'd like to change so uh, if we can the policies where we conduct the sworn in people that day, and be it. Uh, uh, like they have their little picture day and everything. Uh, what I saw, I went with, with this person. People went through is uh, went through the uh, swearing in, and, uh, and then we conducted a meeting. And a lot of people came in to take pictures where their elected officials, and they were left out because we conducted a meeting to eleven o'clock at night. And uh, I hate, I like to change it for anybody that is elected is and we're conducting a ceremony for that, just be that ceremony itself, not, not, not a meeting itself. Understand what I'm saying? I do, so essentially you want a, a special meeting for the swearing in of, of new sure. board of trustee members, okay. Um, yes sir, we do have a policy related to that. It's not on tonight's agenda, but I can get that for you. I already asked and nobody said anything. Thank you. <coughs> Item number three, discussion to repeal of all previously adopted policies and adop adoption of local policies as prepared by TASB Policy Service. Yes, ma'am. So if you recall back in our October meetings, um, we brought together all of the work that um, TASB had done for the district in their policy review and the board approved all of the, um, the recommendations after the administration had gone through and, uh, and tweaked them to make sure they were accurate. So the board has adopted all these policies. Their methodology, however, to ensure that we get all of the new local policies that this board approved in our October meeting is to do a full repeal, everything comes off, and then everything the board approved in October replaces it and it will become the online board book. So we're not proving anything new. <clears throat> it's just a matter of housekeeping. Okay. Item number four, committee concerns. Mr. Rosas, do you have a concern about the swearing in of Board of Trustees here? That's it. We, we, we'll bring that policy back to the next, the next policy meeting if that's what the, the board would like. Okay, item number five, adjournment at seven o'clock. Woohoo!